Hey guys, my name is Nick. I'm a Microsoft Certified Expert Administrator. I create a lot of content for MSPs. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how to deploy the Office Suite out to an iOS device using Microsoft Intune. So I'm in the admin portal here with Microsoft 365 Business, Business Premium as it was recently renamed about a week ago here. And I'm going to go ahead and go into the endpoint management portal here, which I've done already in another tab. And from here, I'm going to go ahead and click on the app section on the left hand side. I already have a device enrolled in the iOS platform that I'm going to be using to show you guys as a test to push out the Office Suite. So if I click on iOS here, I can click on add. You'll see I have a couple of apps already set up for the company portal and the Microsoft Authenticator app as well too for multi-factor. I'm going to go ahead and click on add here. You have the ability to add a iOS store app or other built-in line of business web link. This one's going to be a store app. And from here, you can click on the store app and you can search for whatever you're looking for. In this case, I'm going to look for Office 365. And this is a newer app that they just created here. It bundles together Word, Excel, and PowerPoint. So we'll go ahead and click on Next. We're not going to scope this to anything, and we're going to require it to all devices. So that will force the install. We'll click on Next here, and we'll click on Create. This will take a few minutes, probably 10 to 15, for this to fully push down. But it will show on our devices here. So we have User Install Status and Device Install Status. Our user who's enrolled in the iOS device will shortly see that here and I'll try to capture that on a screen share with that device itself. And in the meantime though, if you click on that device, I'm just showing you multiple locations in which you can see this information. If you click on Managed Apps, you'll see the status as well here. It's waiting for install status on this portal as well. So. I'm going to pop into that device and we'll wait for it to actually install the applications. So back here in the iPhone, we'll get a push notification that's notifying us that the organization is pushing down the Office app. It's not going to cost us anything, but it's going to give us the push notification to hit install. Once we do that, it'll take a couple of minutes to show up here. It only took me about two minutes before it, it fully showed up and was installing there, but it installed completely. And then I could go into the device and access the account that I already have as part of my profile on the device itself. And in this profile, I have the ability to say, there's an app protection policy. So it's going to have me restart that device. And back in the Intune portal here, if we go ahead and we look back down at Managed Apps, and it's gonna say this for a little bit, we could try to refresh here. It always is a delay in my personal experience between what it shows in the actual device between what's in, and what's in the portal. Uh, the other thing that you can check here and wanna look at, like we said, those only apply to the Word, Excel, and PowerPoint, and we additionally want to configure and add other Office 365 applications. So that's where you can go in here and you can say search the App Store. And a big one that I think you would want to install is uh, Teams. And so you can click on Teams there and you can deploy these apps, or you could deploy something like Outlook, for instance. Um, or OneDrive or something like that. So each one can be its own little package there and you can just deploy them and they can all be installed. Pre-configure those obviously before you start enrolling all the devices so they immediately all come down. But that's how you add the entire Office suite to iOS or iPad devices. That's everything I wanted to show you guys today. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below. Otherwise, please like or subscribe to the channel. Thanks guys and have a great day.